a really pleasure to me visit your beautiful country. So thank you for that beautiful welcoming and yesterday. Well, today, at very, very early, we're very glad and honored to that. Um, the name of this universe organization, I'm going to say thank you for all these beautiful things that you make for us. Once again, a round of applause, please, everybody. A huge round of applause for Amos Gilgast. We can now move on to our beloved Nikhil Anansar, the owner of Miss Universe India. So, how was the experience? Good evening, everyone. A huge thanks to all the media who has gathered over here to welcome our Miss Universe and listen to what she has to say about her experience visiting India. And I would like to welcome Mr. Moira Bukaro, the Vice President of Miss Universe. We are very honored that we have but also in different communities that we're going to do in India, thanks to the vision of our national director, we are going to be able to continue to be working in education. We are going to be able to be working also on our projects with the Smile Train and Jack with Talent and, and others. So we feel very proud and definitely we need to be very proud. And we hope that your pageant can bring the best delegate to our national uh, and international competition in November in Mexico City. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Once again, I really hope that you guys have enjoyed your visit and especially tomorrow to the Taj Mahal. I hope it goes where you can. the Taj Mahal, but also I want to tell you that one of my favorite food is that chicken tikka masala. So I'm so excited to to taste the original chicken tikka masala here in India, and I want to tell you. This too, that I'm gonna eat spicy, but I'm going to do a reception for a chicken tikka masala. Uh, another question is, uh, can we see in uh, in coming days in uh, any Bollywood movie? We can see you. They ask that if they can see you working in the Indian movies in future. like the one that we're trying to develop today in India. It's not about flags or even about languages. It's about this bond that nevertheless along the language we have traveled so far away to be able to connect with the people of India and that we can know that we are one universe, a global family. And that's what we're looking for in this, in this universe. So we move aside from any type of uh, diplomatic relationships or politics because we believe that we are already a cultural platform that is built by everyone and not just for one person but for the whole world. Thank you so much. I the future plans for the future. Miss Universe India, there are some changes in this time that are historic. There have been historic changes like we have the high criteria this time. We have the high criteria so that every girl who sees the dream of the Miss Universe platform is an option. और वो अपने आप को इस प्लेटफॉर्म के लिए तैयार कर सकती है। इस साल हमने हर स्टेट में स्टेट डायरेक्टर्स अपॉइंट किए हैं, जो हर स्टेट में रीजनल लेवल पे ज़्यादा से ज़्यादा टैलेंट्स को मौका देंगे, ताकि उनके लिए एक सेफ और एक बहुत कन्वीनिएंट वे फॉर द नेशनल बाज़ेंट होता है। एंड मैं चाहूँगा कि देश के वो हर एक लड़की जिसने सपना देखा है और किसी कारण वो शायद हाइट की वजह से या फिर शायद उनके आसपास ऑडिशंस ना होने की वजह से पार्टिसिपेट नहीं कर पाते थे इस बार उनके लिए मौका है कि वो अपने सपने को जी सकते हैं।